I, um, I, I, I watched a comedy special. I woke up, watched a comedy special. I don't know if you guys watch comedy specials, but I'm kind of weird. I watch comedy specials with the subtitles on. Because cause I like to see how they try to describe the crowd noise. Right? Like this comic got on stage and he was like, how many of you guys do coke? And it was like scattered applause, affirmative whoops. <laughs> That's how some people. Some people. Also, um, on Valentine's Day, don't judge me, please. I watched the movie uh, Fifty Shades of Grey. Uh, check that out. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, all right, let's see if you're still on board. Um, I, also, I also read the book. I read the book, and um, it was kind of amazing that I actually that I actually finished reading the book because they have sex for the first time in like chapter 12, and immediately after, I lost all interest in the story. Like, I was no longer interested in anything she had to say, like her thoughts, like and her monologue, like none of that shit. It was like, okay, he smashed, book over. Like, Denver, I read the book because I heard that women touch themselves to the book, so I had to investigate. Right? And I, I understand it. Like, there were some moments where I was feeling a little aroused, but I have questions. Um, I want to know, do women touch themselves as they read the book? Or do they sit the book down? Because and I just kept losing my place. Like, I'll, just, I'll just give you guys a quick example. Of, like, I read on this look, and um, this is some things that I was going through while I was, you know, while I was trying to make a moment of it. Um, and uh, don't, like, I'm not gonna, like, act out masturbating, but you know what I'm doing. So, so I'm, I'm reading, and you know, it's getting hot, and it's getting heavy, and I'm just like, oh yeah, so uh, he speeds up, I moan. And he pounds on, picking up speed, merciless, a relentless rhythm. And I keep up, meeting his thrust. He, gra he grabs me. Oh, fuck. <laughs> he speeds up. I know, man. You know, and he, like, he's having some trouble, you know? Here we are. The funny, the funny thing about this is that the, in the very next paragraph, um, she says this, she says, um, my thoughts are scattering, there's only sensation, only him, only me. Oh, please, I stiffen, come for me, Anna, he whispers. <laughs> Unravel at his words, exploding around him as I climax and splinter into a million pieces underneath him. What? <laughs> Bitch! Five minutes ago, you were a virgin. And now you're, and now you're coming on command? On command? On command? <laughs> It was fun to read. I was on board with all that. And, but like, and, and like, it's categorized as a romance novel, and I was like, I was trying to be on board. You know, I was trying to give it all a pass, even though the circumstances are so unrealistic. You know, if you don't know, if you're not familiar with the premise of the story, it's basically about a young girl. Um, she's very naive. She's uh, inexperienced. She's a virgin, and she can't understand why she's so smitten and captivated by a man who's young but he's unbelievably rich, and he's powerful, and he's charming, and he's white, and he's tall, and he's gorgeous, and he's mysterious, and he's white, and, and, and he can dance, he can fly a fucking helicopter, he can play a classical piano, and because he lives in Seattle, his skin is fair, he's like, oh, I was like, you know what? I'll give it all a pass. I'll give it all a pass. I'm on board. My only request is that he not have a big dick. That's all I'm asking. You can't, you can't speak fluent French.
French, she know how to French braid hair and just lay ridiculous pipe. Like, <laughs> I'm and of course he does. And the way she describes it, she's like, oh, and then he pulls down his pants, and his penis is such a considerable length, I don't know how it's gonna fit inside of it. I'm like, oh, this thing is bullshit. This is not a romance, this is a science fiction fantasy. It's a French thriller, a motherfucker being an alien, and I hope she dies at the end. 